I Hope She Cheats. I love this song. The song was uh, co-written by Marsha Ambrosius. If you don't know Marsha Ambrosius, she is one half of the brilliant Floetry, who were a, a soul R&B duo that came out of the UK in about the mid to late uh, 90s, early 2000s. And Marsha has written with and for uh, a variety of people since then, Angie Stone, uh, Alicia Keys, Michael Jackson. This song was actually a song that she recorded uh, on one of her albums. At first glance, I think a breakup song, but the key to any great pop song is, I think, the ability to kind of tap a well-worn vein in a new way and kind of find a new angle. The thing that really appealed to me about the song was its humor. It is objectively hilarious, and Marsha is a great lyricist in that regard. The other thing about it is I think it's really a powerful comment on the idea that distraction is something that draws us away from the things that are true and serious and important. We are easily distracted by things that are superficial and kind of, you know, silly and shallow. And there are consequences to those choices and that's the world we live in now. Everybody's distracted by filters and phones and film and everything is artificial. And I really like the idea that the song was kind of, had subtext, that there were more sort of layers to the lyric. And, and that's kind of why we, why we chose the song. It's, I always say that there's really no reason to cover a song unless there's a reason to cover a song. The only way I can explain it really is that as a singer, sometimes, even if you don't write the song, sometimes you feel a real sense of ownership over it when you hear it. And that happened to me. I heard this song and immediately the arrangement just sort of sprang to mind. It's a reimagining of uh, the original version of the song. And it's just a blast to sing, which above all else is, you know, stuff that is, is the thing that singers look for, a song that's fun to sing. <laughs>